Meghan Markle is terribly emotional and decides to miss out on the king's coronation as she and Harry were denied balcony seats. Why is Meghan missing out on the coronation of Prince Charles? Why was she denied balcony access? Let's find out. Meghan Markle has been really upset as she and her children will be missing out on the King Charles' coronation which will be a historical event. It has been confirmed that she won't be taking part in any of it. Meghan's absence at the coronation along with Harry had been speculated for the past few weeks after both of them had been invited to attend the coronation. However, there was no statement from either the royal family or the Duke and Duchess. Meghan Markle's absence is going to be a big win for the royal family, as this might be the end for Harry and Meghan's popularity. However, it seems like she's not going to take this loss lightly. It looks like with every passing royal event, the Duke and Duchess are losing their relevance in the public. It's only time that they become a general nobody and scurry to their boroughs in California. The biggest irony is that they were not just royals. They were working royals before they decided to throw away their responsibilities and their royalty into the ditch. It definitely looks like they're now regretting their decision of doing so. If they had stayed in the monarchy and been obedient, like William and Kate, they would have had a place reserved for them at the balcony for the jubilee as well as the coronation. However, they wanted to be in control of everything and have things their way. Unfortunately, it didn't, and things backfired, and now they're suffering for the dumb decisions they made. Also, it's been confirmed that only working royals will be allowed on the balcony. Looks like Harry and Meghan won't be getting the next photo that will be the trailer for their Netflix documentary. They had demanded that they wanted to be reserved the balcony spot along with their children Archie and Lilibet, not to mention the apology they had been meaning to get but haven't gotten yet because no one gives a damn about them anymore. On the other hand, Talk TV's Jeremy Kyle stated that Meghan Markle's absence at the King's coronation will be welcomed by everybody wholeheartedly. Here's what the Twitter addies had to say about Meghan's absence from the coronation. A user had this to say about Meghan's absence. H&M tried and failed to take them on. Now, just let them skull off into the darkness tired of hearing about them. A user wanted Harry to be absent along with Meghan. The tweet read, Judas Harry's absence would be welcomed by everyone too. Everyone knows why he wants to attend, to get new content to continue thrashing the royal family. However, there were some tweets that supported Meghan's decision. A user said, I bet Meghan is delighted she's not coming too. You tossers would slate her anyway. The Mirror, according to reliable sources, said that Meghan was never likely to come for this coronation as she was put in a very difficult position as Prince Harry had voiced his worries regarding security issues and the royal family's reaction. However, Omid Scobie, the royal author, claims that Archie's birthday lies on the same day as the coronation. This played out to be a major factor that influenced Meghan's decision to be absent. Even though Harry would be attending the ceremony, his presence would be of a short span. However, back in the Platinum Jubilee last year, it was Lilibet's first birthday and the couple were seen at the Frogmore Cottage then and they did celebrate. Therefore, it feels like Meghan's absence might be related to all the accusations that Harry and Meghan made against the royal family along with Harry's memoir Spare that was the epitome of awkwardness. However, several other tabloids have arisen that claim Princess of Wales, Kate Middleton, to have played a role in preventing Meghan from attending the coronation. Tom Bauer, Former BBC journalist claimed that Kate insisted Meghan would not be welcome at the coronation under any circumstances. He also claimed that Meghan was eager to attend the ceremony along with Harry but Kate blocked it from happening. Bauer also said that we should be thankful to Kate for preventing Meghan from coming there under any circumstances. However, if Meghan had decided to come, there was a place reserved for her. In the back. What do you think happened? Why has Meghan been ousted from the coronation? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below.